Welcome back. Today I got some 1911 mags I want to look at. These are from KCI USA. We got an 8 rounder and a 7 round magazine we're going to try out. Now they were nice enough to send these out to the channel. They gave me two of each so that would make it easier on reloading for the video. So what we're going to do is we're going to shoot these out of my Ruger SR 1911. And what we're going to do is we're going to take a few shots at the silhouette target. And then I also got some pumpkins over there I need to get rid of, so we'll shoot at those. And then we will uh, shoot at the uh, plates too and see how that goes. I'm going to do my normal. The first uh, round we're going to shoot uh, brass out of it. Now the brass ammo we're going to be using today. I would like to thank Miner Ammo for sending this out to the channel for us to use and try out for the video. And then the uh, second round will be with uh, Federal Aluminum. And then the one after that will be uh, Tula Steel Case. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, we're out here at about 10 yards. And then the first round is going to be uh, Brass Ammo from Miner's Ammo. We'll do the seven round first and then we'll shoot the eight rounder. That makes shot real good. It's the first time I've shot with gloves with this gun, so I gotta get used to that. I'm not used to shooting. It's about 20 degrees out here today. And uh, this is actually the first time I've done videos in the cold like this, because I didn't start doing videos till April last year. So I'll find my other mag here of brass. Keep pulling out the aluminum ones. So far, these things seem like they're gonna be pretty good on that first one. All right, now we got the eight round one. Let's go ahead and uh, give that one a try. We'll go ahead and shoot at the pumpkins with this one. <laughs> Put some big old 45 uh, holes in there. Now the one thing I just noticed with this 8 round one, hit the mag release, it's not coming out real good. Actually here you can see some wear starting right there. And that was uh, only about the third time I've had this in the gun. This one is not coming out too good. So let's go ahead and give the aluminum a try. Okay now we're going to be shooting the federal aluminum. Seven round mag first, I'll shoot this one at the plates. All those shot just fine. Let's see how the seven round drops. Same way, it's not dropping freely, but that ain't a real big issue. Let's go ahead and we got the eight rounder out. Let's shoot at the pumpkins. <laughs> Putting some big old holes in that. Well, so far they're running just fine. The only thing that I see that might be an issue is these things don't want to drop out freely. They kind of grab a little bit going in too, but besides that, they function great. Let's go ahead and move over to the plates. Okay, now we got the steel Tula ammo. We're gonna do the seven round first, and then we're gonna do the uh, eight rounder. So let's go ahead and give this a shot. That makes shot pretty good. Let's go ahead and give the eight rounder a try. A 
and all those shot just fine. So, besides the fact that they don't drop out real easy, but I think after time, I'm already starting to see wear on it. After time, they might get worn in. But that's the only issue I see with these things is they don't want to drop out real easy. Besides that, these are great mags. They fired everything just perfect. Brass, aluminum, and steel case. So I'd say go ahead if you want to go check KCI USA out. Go snag up some of their 1911 mags. Well, that's all I got for today. Thank you for watching. And I'll see y'all on the next one. All right, you're still watching. That means you watched all of my video. Thanks a lot, and I appreciate it. So now I want you to do me another favor. Go ahead and check the links out down below, because in the links down below, I got my Instagram. And on my Instagram, I post a lot of pictures that you don't see on here, sometimes of upcoming projects. Now, also, I've got my uh, Facebook page linked down there, Jesse B's Outdoor page. And on that link, you'll see all the same great stuff that you see on Instagram. But also, a lot of times, I'll put some deals on there for you to check out. So go ahead and check my Facebook page out for that. And another cool thing is I got links down there for these kind of shirts. So if you like cool 2nd A and Patriot shirts, go ahead and check out those links, and that will send you right to them. Well, that's all I got for today, and I'll see you all on the next one. Bye.